A secret recording is fueling the debate now over the new Texas Rangers Stadium. It involves leaked audio of Arlington's mayor, and CBS 11's Joel Thomas is live near downtown Arlington with how he's responding. Yeah, and the recording is of the mayor talking to a community group. And as you're about to hear, he's frustrated that what he calls a small vocal group seems to be hijacking the election for a new ballpark. A lot of these people are working so hard, they don't have the facts right. And either that or they do not have the intelligence there to, to be able to translate that we're investing money in the entertainment industry to make money. The group opposing a new stadium says those comments are an insult to voters. It was hard to understand whether he was talking about me and the other people in, you know, Citizens for Better Arlington, or if he's talking about all Arlington voters as a whole who are voting against this. Well, that's totally misconstrued, and in fact, uh, that is not the case. It was really uh, specifically discussing a very small group of people. Mayor Williams admits he's frustrated the message for a new ballpark is being thwarted by mailers like this one. It comes from a Dallas group and claims the project will cost far more than promised. It was very disturbing uh, because that's not true. They sent their own letter out, you know, without any input or coordination whatsoever. I mean, that's totally their call, and we agree with it, obviously. The recording also has a dire warning from the mayor about the future of the Rangers in Arlington if voters turn down a new ballpark. The alternative is I'm going to be in there begging the Rangers. That's it. But I don't know if it'll work because there will be blood in the water. Sharks, all of these cities are going to be coming in. Well, Arlington didn't do it, so we're going to do it. It reminds you so much of how Dallas blew it on the Cowboys. Opponents of the new ballpark say that there are no danger of losing the Ranger, Rangers here in Arlington. Both sides agree on one thing. The campaigns will continue to heat up as Election Day nears. Reporting live in Arlington, Joel Thomas, CBS 11 News.